Well, according to, uh, you know, fanatics, it is. You know, they talk about it as if you were releasing, you know, sarin gas or some nerve agent. But in fact, uh, it, it's a completely normal part of the atmosphere. It normally is much higher over geological time in its concentrations than it is now. And so uh, this is more Orwellian, you know, propaganda. It, it's simply not true. If anything, the increased CO2 has been demonstrated to be of benefit and certainly of no, no consequence to the climate or uh, temperatures or anything else. The CO2 that you see out there in the atmosphere means economic development. It means people are alive today because of the CO2 that's out there. It means energy, electricity, transportation, all the things that benefit life, that create and grow our crops, that transport medicines and foods and people to do their uh, um, economically viable activities and therefore have health and welfare and security as a result. Uh, means that that is an extremely valuable molecule. We have put, if you think about it, it's kind of a clever system, we have put plant food into the atmosphere and in the meantime have created much longer and better lives for ourselves. So with all those positives, about the only negative you can think about is will CO2 affect the climate in such a way as to be a problem for people and animal and, and plants to adapt. In our work, our research shows that these rates of change of these parameters in the climate system are, are modest and, and certainly uh, adaptable to. There's been a lot of benefits and uh, naturally all life on earth is dependent on some way from CO2 in the atmosphere because green plants use it and all animal life are dependent ultimately on, uh, on the ability for green plants to carry out photosynthesis and there's been a, a, apparently a, a beneficial effect from increased CO2 in the atmosphere on the biosphere from uh, increasing vegetation and the flourishing of animal life in on the land and in the sea that thrive on uh, the plants that uh, use CO2 to convert that to uh, carbohydrate for other things to live on. If anything, the increased CO2 has been demonstrated to be of benefit and certainly of no, no consequence to the climate or uh, temperatures or anything else.